Hi guys, Evan from Atlantic Outboard here. Today I'm going to do a quick walkthrough on our new in stock 2022 Pursuit DC246. This is a new model that replaced the DC235. It has a ton of great updates and features that I think you're going to love. Let's check it out. One of the big upgrades on this model is a wide boarding door. Hull extensions right here, which is really nice on this model. This boat has a length overall of 25 feet, eight inches. A lot of that is this extended platform here, but it's really great for hanging out around sandbars, tied up to friends if you wanna jump on and off the boat. We have our standard uh, telescoping ladder that all the pursuits have. Okay, really easy to use, nice, easy access. You, the best part about this ladder, as I said before, is you can even access it from the water, not just on the boat. Our boat's equipped with underwater lights. We have the optional ski tow package. We have the standard 300 Yamaha uh, new 4.2 uh, liter motor with the built-in electric steering, which is really nice. Uh, on the port side of the stern of this boat, a really cool feature that Pursuit added to it is we have some storage under here as well. It has a drain. This is really good for a stern anchor or to throw some extra uh, dock lines in it if you're traveling. Uh, really good utilization of space uh, on here on the port side transom. Honing in on the cockpit area on the DC246, our boat is equipped with the optional uh, far port side fold out uh, aft seat. These are really great because they have great lumbar support, really comfortable, but when you don't want to use them, you simply lift up, and they lock into place like this. Okay, so that frees up a ton of space for your cockpit if you want to start fishing. We also have a huge insulated fish box and or cooler with a drain right here, which is a really nice feature. And we have our standard live wall over there on the port side. Really great enhancement from the DC-235 now on the DC-246 is this port side lounge area. Uh, on our aft facing seat, if we want to extend this out, we just lift up a little bit and pull, and that pulls out to a nice big lounger, really comfortable. We also have the standard seat right here with cup holders and handlebar holders uh, off to the port side. But a really nice feature we have as well is this huge drawer under here, which is fantastic for storage, flare kits, uh, purses, etc. Really good utilization of space on this model. Another option that we added to our stock 2022 Pursuit DC246 is the cockpit sink feature. We have a 45 quart Yeti cooler that comes with this package. We have a freshwater sink right here with a Corian countertop and two stainless cup holders as well. Dash layout, really great utilization of space. We have the optional Garmin package on this model, so it comes with the 8612 XSV with the through-hull transducer Chirp and the VHF 315 as well. We have our CL5 Yamaha gauge right here, again, standard. We have our GL audio system right here as well. Uh, one thing I like about this boat is we have a really sophisticated uh, ergonomics of the helm area, specifically off to the starboard side. So we have our Yamaha Hellmaster EX control box, but we also have our USB and 12 volt plug adapters right there. Nice, easy access uh, to use those features. We have an adjustable helm on here, which is standard from Pursuit. Push button, start, stop. Uh, trim tab with indicators, lanyard right here. And obviously here are all your accessory switches, lights, horn, um, etc. On the port side console, you guys will see we obviously have our head compartment, okay? That freshwater head gets fed by our 18-gallon freshwater tank. But we, the holding tank is 6 gallons, so pretty good size holding tank for a good day trip. We have a, a freshwater sink in there as well, to, uh, trash can holder right there with your, next to your toilet paper holder. Really good headroom in it, especially for a 24-foot dual console. Now underneath the starboard console, we have our door to access in here. We have our battery switch compartment in here, which is covered by a door. Really nice access to that. We also store our uh, bow table in here, as well as our bow filler cushion set. All right, finally, the bow area on the Pursuit DC246, very similar to other Pursuit models where we have two large seating arrangements up here that flip back open. These are insulated boxes, okay, that have a drain that goes overboard. But one really cool feature this model has is we have storage cubbies off to the port and starboard side. So for uh, your phones, your wallets, you could put a drink in there. You also have cup holders right here. We have a 12 volt plug off to the port side if you need to charge any electronics. My favorite feature on this new model though is the optional bow ladder. Okay, so this is a really cool design that Pursuit did. This ladder extends out so you have a boarding ladder in the stern of the boat, but you also have one in the bow. Really cool feature by Pursuit. They did a really nice job integrating that into the boat. We have our windlass compartment up here, okay? You can control the windlass from the helm or the bow using the remote. You also have your waste pump out up here and your 18 gallon fresh water tank fill is up here as well. That's a wrap on our uh, walkthrough on our 2022 Pursuit DC246. I'm Evan from Atlantic Outboard. Don't forget to check us out online at AtlanticOutboard.com.